Shalom. Oh my gosh, Shalom. It has been forever, you all. <laughs> it's been forever. And it feels so good to be back on. This is just a temporary, well, it's like a quick touch base. That's what this is. It feels absolutely amazing to be back on my channel, to be back on the classroom, to be back in here. Y'all, like, I feel so good. Oh, my goodness. Um, So I am naturally drained. I am exhausted. I'm tired. I just made it in from my flight a few hours ago. But I have been on the line with so many friends that I haven't spoken to in so long because I stopped talking to them for foolish reasons. And um, talking to them and being lifted up in the spirit and then hearing things that have been occurring, y'all, I have so much to share with you all. Oh, my goodness. But I hope that you all enjoyed your Passover. I did not upload any pictures. I didn't upload any videos of the Passover that or the Passover ceremony that I went to observe the Passover ceremony that I attended, the memorial that I attended. I didn't up, up oh my gosh, I didn't upload anything. I'm sorry, I'm tongue twisted. I'm excited. Like I'm full of so much joy right now, you all. But I didn't upload anything. Um Kind of because I didn't have much time, to be honest with you. And then I have been dealing with so much, so much. But I feel like free, you all. Like, it's like this big, heavy, burdensome weight has been lifted off of my shoulder. And it's just like, I feel, I feel great. Like, I feel so good. I'm, I'm thankful to the most high. You all, I was in like one of the most beautiful Airbnbs. It was so calm, so quiet. And it was just like, it was so relaxing. And I ended up putting all of my electronics away. And I was just in the scriptures, y'all. I was in the scriptures. I was reading a lot of the gospels. Uh, I was So I was in the chamber of gospels. So Lord willing, I may be on momentarily to kind of touch base in some of the gospels. Um, but I'm not sure if we may go into a chamber of, of um, wisdom. I'm not sure, as the Lord wills. But I will be back on. I look to be back on in a few hours. I am absolutely drained. So I do need to take a nap for a bit before I hop on. I just wanted to say, Shalom, Yasharala. I hope that you all are enjoying your Passover, the Feast of Unleavened Bread. And I hope that your ceremony was beautiful. Oh my gosh, because the ceremony that I attended was absolutely amazing. The brothers were mighty. The sisters were beautiful. The children, gorgeous, crying and all. I loved it. Like the food, I didn't eat much of the food. I was just, it just felt overwhelmingly joy filled to be around people that are like minded, you know? And it also feels really good that there is still being a shift and a sifting going on in the nation of Israel because it is needed. It is needed, especially around this time. So, I have so much to share with you all, but it feels good to be back on and nothing and no one will ever again, ever again, like hinder me from doing what I know the Lord has ordained me to do. So I will be back on you all, Lord willing, this evening, worst case scenario, probably tomorrow, but I look to be back on in a few hours. I just need to lay it down and get some rest, get some shut eye. I haven't been at home for a whole week, so it feels good to be back in my atmosphere and my comfort zone. Y'all, <laughs> every time I come back from Georgia and listening to teachings, with the congregation that I that I attend, it it's just like I, I get so lifted in my spirit, like all baggage and anything that I'm dealing with in the spirit. It's like all of that sadness or depression, anxiety, nervousness, everything. It's just like it gets left right there in Georgia. And as soon as I walk in, I'm full of joy again. So I look forward to speaking with you all. As mentioned, we may be visiting a chamber of gospel, but it's possible that we may visit the chamber of um, wisdom. So I look forward to it. Um, I apologize if this is delayed. I'm on my Android. <laughs> I'm on my Android and I'm I'm riding this sucker till the wheels fall off. But I love you all. I hope that you all have an amazingly blessed, beautiful rest of your Feast of Unleavened Breads. Don't forget, stop eating any leaven. And there is still time to get that leaven out of your temple. So do not be living with any leaven in your temple. Let it go. Let it go. Forgive because it is a salvatory issue. We got to apply it, you all. So I look forward to speaking with you all. <laughs> I love you. I love you. I love you. Shalom. <laughs>